Hey there, it's Carly Vinciguera and welcome back to my channel. So I'm going to start this video off with a big announcement. So it is summer now, for me at least. I am out of school, it's summer vacation, and so that means I have a lot of free time on my hands. So that means for my summer vacation this year, 2K17, I'm going to be giving y'all three videos a week. So my new upload schedule will be on Mondays. I'll do makeup videos. It'll be Makeup Mondays. I know, so creative. So if you are into my makeup videos or those are some of your favorite uploads of mine, make sure you come around for every Monday because I'll have something makeup related for y'all. And then every Wednesday will be a vlog upload. So this could be like a daily vlog, like I just like take y'all around in a day. It could be like a morning routine, a night routine, or what I eat in a day, or what I do in a day, stuff like that. So whatever like day of the week is most interesting, I'll vlog it. Um, so it could be like a, a vlog from the week before, like the Thursday or Friday and I upload it that Wednesday, or it could be the Tuesday before. But every Wednesday you'll get a vlog from me, and then on Saturday you'll just get a normal channel upload, like my cooking videos, or you know something else, or whatever, I can't think of any other of my videos now, challenges, you know, stuff like that. That will all be on Saturday uploads. So with that out of the way, let's get on to today's video. So today I'm going to be sharing with y'all my summer 2K17 bucket list. So last summer I made a little bucket list and I kept it in my room in my closet so I could like see it every day of um, all the stuff I wanted to get done over the summer. And having it all written out and in front of me um, really helped me like actually get those things done because I could see it every day and I could see like if I was bored I can go and see oh I wanted to get a henna tattoo. Can I go figure out how to do that? So then I got it all done and it was like a really fun way to, you know, keep up with boredom and keep up with, you know, my goals for the summer. So without further ado, let's get on to my bucket list. I wrote it here for y'all, so I'm just gonna be holding this to read it to y'all. So first thing, and that's actually happening today, is getting voice lessons. I'm so excited. As soon as I'm done uploading this, I'm going to head over to my first ever voice lesson. I'm really excited. I've danced since I was three years old, done theater since first grade, um, but I've never actually been professionally trained in my voice, and that's something I've always wanted to work on. So I'm really excited. Today I'm going to go head over to a voice coach. You know, it may not be the right fit for me, um, and I have to keep going. But I'm getting started right away on that one, so I'm excited. Okay, number two is to get my aerial. It's a flip. Um, it's like doing a cartwheel without your hands. It's a really popular trick that is used a lot in dance. And just to further my you know, skills and skill set and stuff, I want to be able to do an aerial. And I believe I can do it. I'm going to teach myself or maybe go to a tumbling class or something, but that's a goal for myself. I want to work on my tap dancing skills. Tap is my favorite style of dance, and I just want to make sure that I and reminded to keep those skills in tap. <laughs> tap. I went to audition for a local um, theater uh, class. Um, it's a class for the school year and um, you just have to audition for it. So I have it down here to make sure I audition for that. I want to get an acting agent, a talent agent. Um, I'm really further looking to further my acting career and one of the biggest steps to do that is to get an agent, and so I'm looking to do that this summer. That's exciting for me. I want to hang out with a lot of different friends. I tend to want to hang out with just a select few group of people because they're like who I feel most comfortable with because they're my closest friends, but I really want to make sure that I hang out with a bunch of different friends this summer because I made a lot of good connections this, with a lot of different people this school year, and I want to make sure I keep those intact. Okay, then I want to, my mom has this little section of her business that she said I could help her work on. So I, I said I want to work on that with her so I can get to work with my mom, get to like kind of see how businesses run, and so that'll be fun. I have here, I want to eat healthy. In the summer, I tend to think, oh, it's vacation, I can eat whatever I want. But it really makes me feel good, makes me feel good in my soul when I eat good. So I have a reminder on here to eat healthy. I want to make sure I wake up on time most days. I feel like I have the best days when I wake up on time and get my day started. When I sleep in, I tend to just be lazy and have a kind of boring, nothing, no, not productive day. So I have in here, I want to wake up on time most days. I want to get more toned. I've been doing this actually for the past couple months. Not necessarily like, you know, lose weight or nothing like that, but I want to get more toned, you know, more muscular, um, feel more fit, you know, that's kind of the classic summer goal. I want to drink more water. Um, I tend to not drink a lot of water just because I forget, for that's the sole reason. So I have in here as a reminder every day, 
I'm gonna try to drink at least, you know, a couple glasses of water, get one in the morning, one with lunch, you know, one before dinner, one with dinner, you know, a lot of water. I wanna go vegan for a week. I think I might actually make a whole video about this, but I'm totally into like the vegan diet and like, you know, against animal cruelty and stuff like that. So I think I might go vegan for a week. I could never sustain it just because I know for me personally, I find it hard to get protein from like just beans and all the other stuff. I know there's so many ways, but like, I know with the active, excuse me, with the active lifestyle I live, it's just hard for me to go on extreme diets like that. But I'll update you on that. I'm going to try to get a debit card this summer. I know I'm not allowed to and stuff. It's not like a legal issue or anything, but I just keep forgetting and it just makes it hard because I want to order makeup and stuff um, online, but I have to always go through my mom and it's just like a hassle. So I'm going to try to get a debit card. I want to go to the beach. I usually go to the beach every summer, but yeah, go to the beach. I want to get new or better or invest in my skincare. I've had a lot of acne and stuff recently and I don't really know why, probably just, you know, hormones, teenage, puberty, amazingness, but um, yeah, I just want to get better skin care because the one I have right now I've been using for a long time and my skin has kind of built an immunity to it and I'm not liking it. I want to try to find different ways to make money. Um, I'm really, you know, I'm trying to find a way to, you know, be responsible with money and stuff like that, but you can't really be responsible with it if you don't have any of it, so making money. Along with making money, I want to save up to get a MacBook because the computer I have right now, I cannot um, sync with my phone. I can't edit on it. It doesn't have, a, it's not a really like, sustainable laptop. It's just kind of, it fills the needs I had a while ago. It was in my top nine favorite things, my first ever YouTube video. But I'm getting to the point where I need a more sustainable laptop. And if I wanna, you know, up my YouTube game a bit and get a camera, then I need to sync that camera to a laptop to edit. I can't edit it on my phone like I do now, so. I need to get a laptop, so I wanna get a MacBook. I wanna cook dinner more. Um, I really went into food and nutrition and stuff like that, like I said earlier, and um, I really make lunch and dinner for myself, but I always rely on my mom and parents and stuff to cook dinner, but I wanna cook dinner more with my mom, either help her out or make it completely myself, but I have cooked dinner more on here. I wanna keep in touch with my Spanish. I took Spanish at my middle school. Um, I have took it for two years, and I wanna just keep in touch with it because I feel like I could become fluent at some point. I don't know, it's good to be bilingual, I think, especially living in Texas, and like, there's so many people here that speak Spanish, it's kind of good to use as a communication tool, but also to use as another skill set in my acting career. And then I'm also looking to start uh, learning the basics of driving so I can try to get my learner's permit as soon as possible because I want to be able to drive as soon as I'm 16, and I turn 15 in October, so I want to just kind of start learning what I have to do to get my permit. So I'm just gonna kind of research that and see what exactly has to be done so I can just make sure I'm on the path to get it like soon as possible because I wanna drive. And that concludes my summer 2K17 bucket list. I really hope I'm able to get all of these things done. I mean, I think it's doable, it's doable. Um, you guys should be excited for the new video upload. Let me know down below in the comments. Let me know if you're excited for my new upload schedule and if you have any ideas or something if you want to see makeup related vlogs or a regular Saturday upload because I will probably need video ideas pretty soon. Okay, now on to my weekly favorites. So for my song of the week, I mentioned last week that I've really been into SoundCloud recently. And I just love it because it has like variety of music and get to listen to different things, different cultures, different styles and stuff of music that I wouldn't normally listen to and I love it. And I found this playlist that I really like that has a bunch of different like summery music, like upbeat, relaxed, um, you know, feel good kind of music for summer. And I have three songs on that playlist that I'll link down below that I've really been liking. My favorite is called Boardwalks by Little May. It's the Sony Alvin remix. But all three of my favorite songs of the week will be down below. Go check them out. I really like them. And then for my top tuber of the week, I'm really excited about her. I found her, her name is Caitlin Shoemaker. Her video was based around a vegan diet and she really what got me into wanting to go vegan for a week. Um, she has recipe videos, what I eat in a day, vlog, grocery haul, like really cool vegan videos and she makes it look like so easy to go vegan because of all of the cool recipes and food alterations and recipe things she has. So I'll, I'll link her 
down in my description. Make sure you go check her out. She definitely deserves more subscribers because she's amazing. And she's a college grad student. All this, she like spends $30 a week on groceries. It's insane. But I'll link my uh, top song of the week and top tuber down below. Go check them out. Like this video if you liked it and subscribe for a new video every Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday on this channel in the summer. Hope you're having a great summer. Hope you're out of school. And hope you're having a great day. See ya!